welcome to Adara Unboxed. I think you all know what this setup means. It means it's time to try on some clothes! I am super excited because today I am going to be unboxing and trying on my very first clothing haul from Shein! It's the online clothing company that has extremely cheap clothing. I'm excited to see what I got because honestly, I have forgotten what I even picked out. There are a lot of swimsuits in here because I am going to Hawaii. Not to brag, but to brag. I'm gonna preface this by saying the review section on Sheen is scary. Everybody leaves good reviews on Sheen because they get points I don't know, for either leaving a positive review or just for reviewing, but like there are a lot of good reviews and not a lot of good pictures. I'm not too worried about it because Sheen offers free shipping and free returns. So if I end up hating everything, I can just return it all. But I need this stuff for my vacation, so I'm really hoping it's gonna look good. Hey guys, I was just editing this video and I completely forgot to mention that the way that I did my Sheen order was through Rakuten. I've spoken about Rakuten multiple times on this channel. It is a website where if you go to the website that you are wanting to go to through Rakuten, Rakuten will give you cash back on the purchase that you make at that place. So on this order, I think I got 8% back, which was $8.56. I will leave my referral code for Rakuten down below in the description. If you use that to sign up for Rakuten for the first time, we both get a bonus cash back, and then you can start using it on all your online purchases and earn even more cash back. Back to the video. All right, let's get to it. I am excited to open this up and be reminded of what I got. Let's see. Oh, this is so nice. Everything is individually packaged. Bikini. Apparently I got six bikinis. I would like at least two swimsuits to fit me. I also got what I'm hoping will be some good swim cover-ups, a couple of casual tie-dye things that I thought might be good for pajamas, two dresses, and a bag. I thought I ordered a fanny pack and I am now confused. So we'll see what this is when I open it. Where to start? I think I'm gonna check out my little PJ athletic wear type things first. This is a tie-dye something something. I think it's shorts and a shirt. And I got it because I have shorts that are like this already and I love them so much. So I was hoping that these would also be like that. I'm not loving the colors as much as the pair I already have, but it's still cool. It's like this ice tie-dyed material feels very soft. And then there's a big old shirt. Oh my gosh, this shirt is so big. Uh, and this is a small. This is a size small. I'm gonna go try them on. You like? I didn't realize that this was gonna be so big. Whoops. Even these shorts are like, they're just weird. And they're so high-waisted. Um, but they are comfortable and I'm gonna use them as sleep shorts. So I don't think that this is going to be returned. Also, I figure like, even if I was not wearing the shorts, I would wear this little shirt just as like a nightgown, as like a cute little nightgown. I love the shirt. I think that this is a similar type thing. It's tie dye. I don't actually remember, let me look. Yes, similar kind of little shorts, but these aren't tight fitting, they're looser. And then a little, oh yeah, this one's a crop, I forgot. A little crop top. Let me go try her on. I am also keeping this. This might actually go with me to Hawaii to be my sleep outfit. I think it's so cute. Okay, I think I'm like too old to be wearing crop tops, but also I'm at the point where I'm like confident enough to actually do it. I never would have been before. So now I'm trying to like revel in it. I want all the crop tops. I want all the little high waist shorts and they got a little bit of stretch and I just feel like so comfy. I love it. Next. 
it's one of these little bags, a little cross body, but like backpack style bag. I'm not 100% sure if I like this. It has a zipper on the back, so like if you're walking and you're worried somebody might come up behind you and try to open your bag and like get into your stuff, like at least you could put your important stuff here, it's gonna be on your back. It feels very inexpensive. It really feels like it's probably gonna start splitting a few uses in, but it was super cheap. So if I'm buying this just kind of for my vacation, yeah, it could work. All right, friends, I think it's time for me to try on some bikinis. It looks like this. It's like, it looks like a little dress, but it's a swimsuit and it feels like swimsuit material. It has, um, oh, this is the underneath. Oh, that's kind of weird. It's like got meshy stuff kind of in the middle. That's strange. Let me go see what this one looks like. Ooh la la. Um, this is adorable. Adorable, what a cute little swimsuit. The only thing is like, I don't feel like there's a lot of support up here. So I don't know that these uh, ladies are gonna stay in place. There are pads and there is quite a bit of coverage here. So maybe you'll be fine. Yeah, I think I like it. I think I'm gonna keep her. I think that this is a great option for days when I'm like, I don't wanna shave. <laughs> All right, next. I don't think I'm gonna like this one. It's supposed to be like a high waist bottom and then this little kind of tie dye top. Let me go try it on before I knock it. Okay. It's cute, but it's not my favorite, and I think it's gonna go back, and I'll tell you why. Like, I this feels too high for my booty. I feel like super awkward and uncomfortable, and I know if I wear it out, I'm just gonna be pulling on it the whole time. And then this doesn't have, this should have more support underneath the ladies, and it doesn't. It's kind of loose, so they're just gonna like fall and like sit in between, and then that makes me worried that if I like jump into water, the whole thing is just gonna fly up. Yeah, it's too bad because I really like the color, but I don't think I'm gonna end up keeping this one. This is a cute little coral number, and it's a one piece, and this was a last minute addition, so I hope it's gonna be cute. Let me go see. Whoops, editing Adara here. I literally finished trying all of these clothes on like an hour and a half ago, but when I just went to look at the footage, my microphone messed up and now I need to re-record the rest of that video. So if the lighting looks different and the audio sounds different, I'm sorry, I'm learning, I'm frustrated, but I'm also excited to try all these clothes on again, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> all right, back to the regularly scheduled program. Okay, I've already decided against this and I'm gonna tell you why because I know what you're thinking, it's super, super cute and it is on the top, but the bottom. I'm sorry, this feels like my vagina's just gonna eat it. <laughs> yeah, this just feels super, super awkward, which sucks. Like, why couldn't this have just been like a normal cut? This would have been perfect. Ugh. On to the next. Okay, up next is this cute little marble one piece with cutouts. Be right back. Ooh. All right, again, I know what you're thinking. Adara, it's so cute. That one's gotta be a winner, right? No, <laughs> when I was filming earlier, I definitely had a nip slip. This piece is not stable enough. It just wants to keep going this way. It doesn't hold up. It is super cute, but this will not stay on this boob. And unfortunately for that reason, she has to go back. Next up is this cute other one piece, little stripies, and it comes with a belt. I'll see you in just a second here. Okay, this one also is very cute, and I would be very tempted to hold on to it. It has a really cute cut in the back and in the front. However, although this part is fine, it is too big on the sides, and I just don't think that that is gonna make me comfortable to go swimming. I feel like a lot of Sheen swimsuits seem to be made for women who are a bit bustier than I am. Last swimsuit is this cute little tie-dye number. This one was interesting to me because it's a one piece, but the top is sheer, and you wear a little bikini, string bikini top underneath. 
Let me see what this one's like. This one I do like, and I think I'm gonna hold on to it. It does have an issue. <laughs> Let's start with the good. It's really cute. It's a super cute one piece. I feel like it's unique in that the top is like this mesh layer. It's disconnected from the top, but connected to the bottom. My problem with it is that like, this is not a boob cover. This is a nipple cover. This is way smaller than what the lady was wearing in the photo. So like in the photo, they like wear it like this. I'm sorry, I can't do that. My whole boobs are falling out. So I think I'm gonna end up keeping this one. On to the cover-ups. This is a little kind of wrap around dress thing and I'm actually glad that I'm re-recording this because <laughs> when I recorded it earlier, I thought this was a skirt and it's not. So now I can put it on the accurate way. Okay, I do think that this is cute. I do. I mean, I wouldn't wear this around. I'd wear it only on the beach and I like a cover-up that I can wear around during the day. This is too high, it's gonna show things that I don't want it to show while I'm walking around. So I think this is probably gonna go back. Another reason is because I bought another dress that's this exact same material with the intention of only keeping one thing. That one is not a cover-up, it's a dress, but this is what this little cover-up looks like. It's definitely not bad, I just don't think I love it. Next up is this cute little cover-up kind of hippie. This one's cute, right? I think I really like this. I feel so like bohemian and like hippy dippy and it just feels nice. It feels like nice material. I love all these little jingle jangles happening and I think that this is something cute that I could wear around during the day. I can wear it kind of wherever so I think I'm gonna keep this one. Last cover up, this is a slightly different, but it is like a tie dye cover up. I like this one too. I just feel so cool in it. It makes me feel like I'm a cool person. And you know, I did the one shoulder thing, but like, you can also just not do that. This is cute too. I love the colors, right? I think it's cute and I think I just need some cute little sandals and I'm gonna rock this. All right, now we are on to the dresses. I bought two dresses that I just thought were like cute things to wear. I guess this one technically isn't a dress. This is a jumper, romper, what you might call it. It's little shorts but it has this cute little embroidery on it. I don't love the fabric. It's really thick, but it just doesn't feel like breathable. It feels kind of like sticky too. Let's try it on. And here's this little number. I really like this one and I think it's adorable. I think the only thing it's missing are pockets, but I can't really expect pockets because I know that these things are very inexpensive, so. I'm happy with this cute embroidery and this cute little bow. It's just a little bit of tum tum. I think it's very cute. And this one's a keeper. Last but not least is my dress finale. So as you can see, this is the same material as that swim cover up, but this one is a little bit of like a little strappy dress. So hopefully it's cute. Oh, hello there. This one is so cute. I just feel elegant. It is really long. I'm just noticing that right now. But I just, I think it's super cute. It's really lightweight and flowy and strappy. And I just think it's adorable. That was everything. Thanks for hanging in there with me. If you feel like checking out Sheen for yourself, I have left a referral link down in the description that will get you 10% off your order. As always, thank you so much for joining me. Please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't, and I'll see you next time for another Adara Unboxed Adventure. Bye.